Hello, my name is Sungbin and I'm currently a fourth year student at the University of Toronto Scarborough. I'm double minoring in women and gender studies as well as majoring in political science. Welcome to my classical world in film project, which is a video analysis on the 2004 historical adaptation film called Troy. Today I will assess the tense scene of Berseus, Achilles, and Agamemnon's scene at 54 minutes of the movie which starts us off on the evaluation of the relationship and role of Berseus in the character development of Achilles, in which she humanized the character of Achilles throughout the movie and made him into a better warrior who was more compassionate and wise. Despite Berseus being Achilles' war prize for his fighting efforts in the war, the two actually do end up falling in love. This scene highlights the changing nature of Achilles, in which Achilles has a new weakness which Agamemnon can use to tame Achilles. This foreshadows the demise of their own relationship as well as the results of the war. Throughout the movie, Achilles has shown that he has had issues with authority, especially listening to authority and orders. He loves the glory of winning wars and the respect that he gets. With that being said, he has an honorable side to him that Agamemnon lacks in. Despite being the ace of the army and having the most capabilities as an individual who can single-handedly lead the Spartan army to glory, does not want to take the orders of Agamemnon, nor does Achilles agree with the rule of Agamemnon. Agamemnon, who needs Achilles to win this war and take over Troy, holds Berseus over his head. Monuments to victory on every island of Greece. I'll carve Agamemnon in the stone. Be careful, King of Kings. First, you need the victory. Your men sacked the Temple of Apollo, yes? You want gold? Take it. It's my gift to honor your courage. Take what you wish. I already have. Afarius! Hemon! I will break down how the female agency within this film overall was muted and essentially diminished. For the purpose of enhancing the mainstream male hero trope to further push matriarchal ideologies and promote historical inaccuracies in the depiction of women and especially gender roles, this not only devalues femininity as a whole, but fuels toxic masculinity. Is your only talent, the controversy and detriments with minimizing the female voice and influence, especially in historical films, are that it creates erasure of a woman's value and their existence in shaping history. My minimizes their existence within Silence. the historical context. In this scene, we witness how Berseus is taken from Troy and held hostage on the camps of the Spartans as a prize for the army who are at odds with the Trojan. Then. Who knows? You sack of wine! Before my time is done, I will look down on your corpse and smile. In this scene, we witness how Berseus is taken from Troy and held hostage on the camps of the Spartans. The scene arguably captures the changing nature of Achilles and the agency of Berseus. Berseus is one of the few women or even people who challenge his character other than his mother. Berseus is essentially placed as a character enhancement plot for Achilles. When Agamemnon states, my dear Achilles, silence by a slave girl, this provokes further anger and hatred towards Agamemnon, which ironically showcases the power and agency as well as influence that Berseus had over Achilles. Anger issues that is quite present within Achilles, which is a character flaw that Berseus eventually brings out. Berseus is there to serve the character plot of Achilles, his identity discovery, as well as to confront him with his violent anger issues. She is instead referred to as the spoils of war by Agamemnon, like a property of a male figure, which mirrors the way Helen is also treated. She plays a significant role by soothing the rage and brutality of Achilles by bringing out the compassion, love, and vulnerable nature within him, making him question his own values and purpose as a warrior. The breakdown of this scene brings us to the bigger dilemma of this movie and the Iliad. The war is sparked by the beauty of Helen and the fall of the undefeatable Achilles, 
In the movie, it's because of his love for Briseis. Yet the women who had the most influence over the war, who were essentially victims, are the most demonized. Such as Helen and Briseis who were seen as catalyst of the war, as well as possessions to be won over by powerful men. Unfortunately, despite how much influence Briseis had over the character development of Achilles, she is not remembered or echoed through history for her role as a peacemaker and who loved justice, honor, and didn't want to see any unnecessary bloodshed and as someone who challenged the greatest warrior of Greek mythology at the time, Achilles. This now brings us to the end of my video analysis on the 2004 film Troy by Wolfgang Peterson on the scene with Perseus, Agamemnon, and Achilles. Thank you for watching till the end of my video.